Colin Brown on the racetrack. All these trucks are pushing each other, trying to get the advantage. Here comes Colin Brown once again. On behalf of all Conway Freight employees, I'd like to welcome you to NASCAR. We appreciate you being with us here today. Our goal or mission at Conway is simple, to be the best LTL carrier in the industry by delivering exception free, on time and fast service to our customers. The success we have enjoyed is because of the years of support from our loyal customers, as well as the hard work, dedication, and customer service provided by our experienced, reliable, and responsive employees throughout North America. To our valued customers, thank you for placing your confidence in our company. We appreciate your business. To our employees, thank you for all you've done and will do to make Conway Freight the LTL performance leader. Another cause for celebration for Conway Freight is the 2008 NASCAR Truck Series Race Bestest Rookie of the Year winner, Colin Brown. Colin's rookie season included three top five finishes, eight top 10 finishes, and Colin qualified in the top 10 18 times. Enjoy your time at the track, getting an inside look at NASCAR, and most importantly, meeting the driver of the number six Conway Freight Ford F-150, Colin Brown. Colin will be here shortly to answer your questions, and I think you'll really enjoy it. Next up, we'll give you some insight about Colin's career and to give you some ideas for your own questions from an interview he had recently with our Vice President of Marketing, Bill Wynn. Let's take a look. The drive to perform. Look at Colin Brown making the move to the inside. The drive to deliver. And you can see Colin Brown closing quickly. Colin Brown will drive by him on the outside. The drive to win. Side by side, Colin Brown jumps to the inside of his teammate. Lives here. Here. And here. Did you see that? He dropped back to the 23rd position, and now he's got the lead back. This kid understands the draft, and he's proving it in the late going here today. There's the six truck of Colin Brown. There's a battle for fourth. That's Colin Brown, the Conway Ford. To some, he's a fresh-faced kid driving fast cars. But those who've seen him drive know he's a racing superstar in the making. When you drive in normal traffic, you have the urge to leave everyone behind. Not really. I'm one of these guys that I drive pretty much the speed limit. And I say that most. Time. I've only ever gotten two speed tickets in my life. How old are you? <laughs> I'm old now. I'm 20. Yeah. So I mean, that gave me four years of driving. One thing's for certain. Colin Brown has never settled for less. I remember being a little kid watching these you know, NASCAR truck races or the Nationwide Series races on TV and, you know, always thinking, man, that would be so cool to be able to do that and make a living doing that. And my dad was a race car engineer when I was growing up, so obviously when I was a young kid, I was interested in what my dad was doing and wanted to, you know, be part of what he was doing. And growing up in racing was what I thought was just normal. We did all of our own racing. When I raced quarter midgets and go-karts and the open wheel formula cars, that was all our family team. Uh, my mom and my, my brother and my dad, we all pitched in and helped, you know, worked on the car. We didn't have any hired mechanics or didn't have a hired team that, you know, did all the work for us and drove the truck and trailer. I mean, we did all that. From his early days of racing quarter midgets to international kart racing and formula cars, Colin has always been driven to perform, excelling at every level of competition. I think a lot of it is just the drive that my parents kind of instilled in me when I was growing up as a kid and, you know, always committed to doing something 100% the right way. Yeah, nice job, bud. Everybody wanted me to be able to succeed and, you know, have my dreams come true, I guess, and, and that's, uh, I don't think you can ask for more than that. By age 18, Colin had assembled one of the most impressive driving resumes for a young race driver, earning the distinction of being the youngest Rolex Daytona prototype driver the youngest driver to win a Major League North American Auto Race, and the youngest driver to stand on the podium at the prestigious 24 Hours of Le Mans. After winning the 2007 Racer Magazine Rookie of the Year Award, Colin caught the eye of Jack Roush of Roush Fenway Racing, leading to a long-term contract with Roush Fenway Racing and Ford Racing, 
to drive the number six Conway Freight Ford F-150. I would say our rookie season in the NASCAR Truck Series was an exciting one, uh, one where I learned a lot. A little side-by-side -side racing, Colin Brown on the inside of David Starr. We had some great races, we had some races where I felt like we were in a contention to, you know, top five, top three, a few of the places, and unfortunately it didn't work out for us in, in a few instances. Oh, Skinner had a... We got traffic jam right there coming off of Pitt Road. You, know, you got to be smart about when to race those guys, and I feel like towards the end of the season I started to learn a little bit more about that, and, you know, I kind of got a little bit more comfortable with uh, being able to run in 10th or 11th or 12th in the middle of the race, knowing we're going to have a truck that's going to be up front at the end of the race. Collins' drive to succeed at the NASCAR level allowed him to persevere through some rough spots during the 2008 season. What about the rookie leader in points? That would be Colin Brown riding in the fourth position. This is a driver that's gotten better and better as the year has gone on. And ultimately, deliver on his goal of winning the 2008 Ray Bestos Rookie of the Year. Well, that was great to win their best rookie of the year. Um, that was something that Conway Freight and Ford Motor Company and Jack Roush all set out at the start of the year as a goal for us. And it was uh, definitely a good thing to win. See Colin Brown go by on the inside. How about Colin Brown right here? Just drove by that 51 truck. And you see right behind him, Colin Brown trying to take a position away from the 33. Having the yellow stripe off the truck is kind of a sigh of relief and a monkey off our backs. I feel like that kind of, you know, put us behind the eight ball even to begin with, even before we turn the lap on the racetrack. So I feel like having that yellow stripe gone is going to be a huge help. What did you learn, though, in that rookie season? Just learning how to race with the veteran drivers, that was the biggest thing. They have uh, you know, so many different things that they can do to you with the air, with how your truck's working, and where they can put their truck that makes you know, your truck do nasty things. So um, learned a lot about how to get those guys to try and respect you and get to be part of the group, I guess. Now, Colin sets his sights on the next major milestone in his career, delivering the 2009 NASCAR Camping World Truck Series title to Roush Fenway Racing, Ford Racing, and Conway Freight. Well, I think to win a Camping World Truck Series race, you have to have a lot of different things come together. Rosh Fenway went from having three trucks to having one truck in 2009. I feel like that's going to help us a little bit. Having 100% of the effort focused on our number six Conway Freight Ford F-150 truck, and I think that's going to help make sure that the truck that we do have has the best of everything, has the best people, and you know everybody's working towards that goal. I feel like our team is probably one of the best teams in the garage just because it's a group of people that I feel all really want to be there just because they know they have a job to do and they want to be the best at it. I think, you know, Conway Freight's four core values of safety, integrity, commitment, and excellence are all values that align really well with what we're doing at Roush Fenway. Obviously, Conway Freight is, is you know, a high-performance company. Whoa, 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 it's exception-free, on-time, fast.